Yes, Linda, I'm ready. Hi, this is Trees with Polka Dots, and I'm here today to talk to you about a question I get often. What is mixed media? That is a good question. Mixed media, in this case, is a stamp that has many things going on within it. There's, so there's newsprint and a measurement and a flower. So what do I do with that? How do I color that? Which is a really good question. So I'm going to use some distress inks, which are, some of you may already know, are very workable inks, we like to call them. And I'm actually going to just rub them across my little non-porous um, tray here. You can even use a plastic baggie. Anything that's not porous is going to work. A dinner plate, which if it's flat works great. So lots of different things. Now the ink's going to slowly dry on there, which I don't want to happen. So I'm going to just moisten it with just, this is plain water. You can also use other misting uh, um, items, which might give it some other flavor. So now I've already stamped my mixed media image on my paper. And I'm just going to easily place this down. You can even kind of squoosh it around a little bit if you can. Get that color mixed and pull it off of there. And I have a beautiful arrangement of color on my mixed media stamp. So the st background of the stamp does all the work for you. This is, you're just applying color. Let's transfer that to just a fun, adding a brad, some other embellishments. I love tool. Tool is so airy and elegant that you could do so much with it. So, mixed media is here to stay. And it's nice to learn how to work with it. And I hope I showed you a way or two.